So I'm on Route 1A south. Just left um, Hamlin and I'm heading down toward uh, Limestone. And I approximate this is where Garrity kissed the girl. It's really windy out and there's lots of bugs. <laughs> Let's try. So they were. They were, the book says they were passing more houses now, and that's true. When I left Hamlin and came down 1A for about three miles, there were no houses, and then suddenly there were a lot of uh, houses. A lot of them are abandoned now. Small houses, abandoned houses. Garrity, McVries said, my, my, look what you got. A pretty girl of about 16 and a white blouse and red checked pedal pushers was holding up a big magic marker sign go go Garrity number 47 we love you Ray main zone so that happened right about here is my approximation and you can check a link in the description for the um, Google Map Street View and you can check it out Garrity felt his heart swell. I have to stop to read. Let me take off my glasses as well. My apologies. He suddenly knew he was going to win. The unnamed girl proved it. To hell with hint 13. Hint 13 is conserve energy whenever possible. Garrity ran over to the side of the road. The girl saw his number and squealed. She threw herself at him and kissed him hard. Garrity was suddenly sweatily aroused. He kissed back vigorously. The girl poked her tongue in his mouth twice, delicately. Hardly aware of what he was doing, he put one hand on a round buttock and squeezed gently. Warning, warning 47. Now I wanted to make a note. He didn't get a warning for kissing the girl. People have <laughs> implied that in their reviews. Do you see all these bugs? Crazy. He got a courtesy warning because his two minute timer dropped to 30 seconds. So I just wanted to point that out. Garrity stepped back and grinned. Thanks. Oh, 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 sure. Her eyes were starry. He tried to think of something else to say, but he could see the soldier opening his mouth to give him the second warning. Again, he's not getting a warning for not complying with, with the first warning, of not kissing or something like this. His timer is about to hit 60, the second warning threshold, the two minute death timer. trotted back to his place, panting a little and grinning. He, he was a little uh, guilty. He felt a little guilty after Hint 13 just the same. Olsen was also grinning. For that, I would have taken three warnings. And what Olsen is saying, he would have lost at least 90 seconds off his death timer, two minute death timer. And people, people don't understand this. They, they say, oh, you get a warning every 10 seconds. If you stop, you get a warning. It kind of feels that way, because in, in this case, when you read through it, it, sort of feels like 10 seconds have passed between the first warning and the second warning, you may, you may interpret. But it is all about the 30 seconds between warnings. So, Let's say Garrity's timer is about 63 and he walks an hour without getting a warning. It means he loses a warning. Now at 63 he would have one warning back at 30. And what would happen is he'd lose that first warning. So his um, 
his timer would not get set back to 90 because that's that's the first warning it would get set back to 120 and he would have no warnings he only has one warning at 63 he's three seconds from his second warning and when he loses his first warning his timer goes back to 120. he must be careful not to get um sorry he trotted back to his place panting a little grinning he was, uh, um, yeah, we, we read that already. Garrity didn't answer, but he turned around and walked backward and waved to the girl. When she was out of sight, he turned around and began to walk firmly. An hour before, um, an hour before his warning would be gone. Uh, he must be careful not to get another one. So at, at this point, he is like three seconds from his second warning. So his timer is about 63. He must be careful not to get another one, but he felt good. He felt fit. He felt like he could walk all the way to Florida. Now the um, the route does go all the way to Florida. It goes to Key West, where it just ends. I've actually um, let me switch. My hands getting tired. I hear a big truck coming. Um, I've traced Route One all the way down to Key West, Florida. So they say, um, I could walk all the way to Florida. Uh, there's a lot of logging trucks going by now. So looks like a, let's see what, go, what this is. Uh, it's just a tractor. So he started to walk faster. Ray McVries was still smiling. What's your hurry? Yeah, that's right. Hint six. Slow and easy does it. Thanks. <laughs> Sorry, I'm uh, bouncing you around, tilting you. I had to switch pages. McVries went on smiling. Don't thank me too much. I'm out to win too. So I was just showing that scene as to um, this is this is about where it happens. You got a, a couple of houses here, and um, it's pretty remote. It's pretty beautiful, actually. So, just trying to emphasize the two-minute warning, since nobody does that. Um, it's it's not about doing something wrong, like kissing a girl, and you get a warning. Um, it's really about the timer. And. Um, Penalty warnings are also about the timer, and when you walk an hour without a warning and lose a warning, that's also about the timer. All right, well, I, I would love to walk this uh, this long walk. It's actually intriguing, but um, I don't know if this long walk project is going to go that far. <laughs> how, how long would it take me to walk 360 miles, you know, and, uh, and document it? But... Um, it is beautiful. Have uh, been lucky to get some great weather. Anyway, till next time, guys, stay on your long walk of life, and I will talk to you later.